Navigator has several unique capabilities to help you better understand property acquisition as well. In this case, let's put in an address in Park City that just went up for sale. Now we have a good idea of the area. Select the Polygon tool. We're going to draw a precise boundary around this property. Now, let's get a lay of the land. You can get a very detailed understanding of an area. For example, what I can quickly discern about this property is that it's above the town center. What I can also discern is it's still a little ways from the chairlift. If I wanted to be able to market my home as a ski in, ski out, this is likely not the place. However, let's understand better how nearby people are performing. In this case, we're going to find the properties with the highest nightly revenue. These are the properties that apply. Click in view, 33 listings. Let's add all of these to the set. Now, because we want a precise understanding of this market, we're going to go eliminate a few of the worst performing properties. What I want to get down to is just 25 properties here so I can get precise understanding of these listings performance. Great. Now I'm down to 25 listings. I'm going to save this set and I'm going to call this Park City Acquisition Set. Click Create Set. Soon after you create your set, the View Metrics tab will appear. Let's click this to learn more. The most powerful inter interface for you will likely be your calendar or your metrics tab. With a set under 25 listings, you'll be able to see specific information for all of these listings. You can analyze it here or click to export it as a CSV or copy this into a Google Sheet. Again, you have your calendar with pricing signal, metrics where you can analyze performance. You also have graphs and trends as well. You can export all of this data to inform more precise underwriting of any address.